Okay, so today we'll be going over the programming of the Baofeng UB5R, which is very, very simple. The UB5R is one of the cheapest and the smallest UHF, VHF ham radios that are out there. So without any further ado, let's get started. Um, as you'll see, I got top and bottom channels. We can rotate through using the A and B buttons. Let's put that, go ahead and put the active channel up on top. Now to program on my frequency, I need to be in frequency mode. Right now I'm in channel mode. You can tell with the two little channel numbers right there on the right, channel 5 and channel 0. I can't type in a frequency that way. So I'll go ahead, push the big yellow button. Frequency mode. Channel mode. mode. Frequency mode. And make sure we're in frequency mode. Now I'll punch in my favorite repeater frequency, 145.310. One, four, five, three, one. Zero. And I can listen to my favorite frequency, but I can't talk to it because I haven't punched in my PL tones or my offset. Not a problem. We'll go ahead and go into menu. Menu. And we'll start at zero. Keep your squelch down to about one. If you got squelch two or three, you may not be able to hear the weaker frequencies. But let's go ahead and enter our CTC, CTC assess tones. That's also known as PL frequency. That's going to be menu number menu. 13. Now to change that, I need to be on 88.5. I just hit menu again. CTC. Use the number keys, 88.5, and hit menu again to save. Confirm. And it says confirmed. Next one's going to be menu 25. That's going to be my shift direction or my offset shift. I'm going to hit menu again. Direction. Now I'm going to go down. I need it to be negative. Hit the menu again Confirm. to save. Go up one more to menu number 26 for offset. Hit offset menu. Offset frequency, zero, 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 six, zero, zero, confirm. And now my offset and direction and my PL tone has all been set for my repeater. Now, can I chunk the repeater? Let's test it out. And I just hit, I just chunked my repeater, the 145.310. Well, that's great, but how do I save this to a channel? Really simple. Go back into the menu. Go up to menu number 28. Delete channel. Before I can save a channel, I have to delete the channel. So go ahead and hit menu again. Delete channel. And I want my favorite re repeater to be on channel one. I'll hit menu again. Confirm. And it's confirmed. If you don't see a CH dash in front of your number, you have not deleted your channel, but as that CH dash is gone. Delete channel. As it's gone, I know it's been deleted. I did not delete channel two, I deleted channel one. Not a problem. Menu. Our next thing to do is to go ahead and add the channel. I'm gonna do menu Memory again. Memory channel. Memory channel. I know it's been deleted, no CH, 001 is the one I want. Hit menu again. Repeat memory. And now channel one is set. I'll exit out. See if I can chunk the repeater. I can do it in frequency mode. And when I push, channel mode. put it back in channel mode, I can see channel one right there. 145.310, channel one, chunk it. Perfect, I never have to type that in again. I'll go down to my bottom frequency. If I go up to channel, from channel 0 to channel 1, one. there it is, 145.310. This is KI5ONA. Have a great day.